Hey, this is Adam with Tech Dive AV Club, and today we're going to be talking about how to multicam edit, like changing between cameras really easily with Vegas. Hey, this is Adam. We're in Movie Studio 17 Platinum, and we're going to talk about one of the fancier features Movie Studio has, which is multicam editing. So first I'm going to grab in both cameras and I'm going to drop them in my project media. That is the file from both cameras. And I'm going to delete this picture in picture and track because it's going to get in our way right now. And the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to drop in this first camera and hit yes. Actually, no, control Z. I'm going to drop in my primary camera and I'm going to hit yes on my primary camera because that's the one I want it to be. That's the prettier camera. That's the one I want Vegas to match the project settings for. The crappier camera I'm going to drop in second and let that one match my project settings for the other. And uh, you can just highlight a single clip. So if you have them both highlighted, your audio and video are going to move together. But if you highlight one, you can drag it up to the clip above. And now we've got two cameras. So the greatest way to sync them is I've clapped right here. You can see really loudly there should be a clap. And so I've done that twice. So now it's super easy to just line up my audio. I'm going to click on one, zoom in, and then I'm zoomed in a ton right now and get these just about perfect. So these, uh, there is ways to get perfect sync in Vegas. I'm not super worried about that because I'm not actually lining up my, uh, this is this is within a fraction of a second synced right now. And I'm not actually lining up or mixing audio because I'm only gonna be using audio from one of these. But uh, what you can do is you can highlight all the things you want to come in. So uh, for this case, I only want one audio and two videos. I'm gonna highlight them and then I'm going to go to Tools, and I'm going to go to Multicam, and then I'm going to go to Create Multicam Track. And then I'm going to go to Tools, Multicam, and hit Enable Multicam Editing. So now I know about right here is where my actual video starts. You can kind of select the audio that you want. So I'm going to mute the audio I don't want here. So the camera I wanted to start with is the one I'm looking at. So I'm going to start over here with that camera. And it's going to make a cut every time I select the camera. And it, the highlighted camera is the one that is on. So every time I look at a different camera, I want to have that camera selected. All right, so that's it. That's that's the multicam edit, and I was able to do all those cuts super fast. Now, when you watch it back, you'll notice that the highlight still follows; it still remembers my choices. Right. So there we go. So now, if we go to tools. We go to multicam and we disable multicam editing. You can see it'll actually choose, have chosen the video that I have. So the whole preview, the whole video will be the primary one, the one that I've chosen. So if we watch it back again, so one of these was a little rough right here. Not that one, this, this one. So I want it to change a little sooner while I'm pointing. So I can actually scroll that back and then scroll this one forward. And then when they snap together, you can change your edits. You can create fades, all that stuff. The same editing right there. But you very, very quickly have selected the camera that you wanted. So you can imagine if you have four cameras set up recording a concert, all starting and ending at roughly the same time, get them synced. Put them in a multi cam track, select the camera you want when you want it. The majority of your product will be edited, and you can come back and do little nips and tucks uh, to make sure that it's all exactly how you want it before you render out. When I render out this section right here, this is going to be 
the video is just going to be cut like the video I want it to be cut like. So thank you so much for watching. Like if this video helped you out. Subscribe if you're looking for more. If you're new to editing, you can check out my new to editing tutorials here or also my Udemy course where I teach you about some of the more ins and outs of editing theory as well. And if you buy or upgrade anything through my affiliates link, that helps out this channel a ton. Thank you so much for watching. I got more coming out on the way. I'll see you next time.